Imagine a peaceful place called an ashram, where the air smells like flowers and birds are always singing. Here, a wise Buddhist monk guided his students on their spiritual journey. One of the students often spoke badly about others behind their backs and always praised himself. He believed he was the smartest and the best, reminding everyone of his rich background and the big sacrifices he made to join the ashram. One day, the monk called all his students together and said, for the next month, each of you must make a resolution. This will test your willpower and make you stronger inside. Choose a resolution that suits your abilities, and if you fail, you will go back to your old routine. The students eagerly made their resolutions, each according to their capability. But the boastful student approached the monk directly, seeking a grand challenge. I don't want a small resolution. Give me something worthy of my greatness, he demanded. The monk smiled and replied, Are you sure you can fulfill the resolution I give you? It won't be easy. Confidently, the disciple responded, I can do anything you ask. Very well, said the monk. Your resolution is to remain silent for the next month. Not a single word should leave your mouth. The student thought this was easy and agreed. The first day was simple, but by the second day, it became hard not to speak. By the fourth day, he felt very uneasy. Watching his fellow students talk, he really wanted to join in, but he couldn't because of his resolution. The silence made him feel uncomfortable and even sick. Desperate, he wrote to the monk, I can't breathe without speaking. Should I break my resolution? The monk replied, resolutions are often broken, but keeping them builds inner strength. If you can't handle this small task, how will you manage the challenges of life? The choice to break or keep it is yours. Hurt but determined, the student retreated to his hut, isolating himself further. Fifteen days passed, and most students had broken their resolutions. Yet, the once talkative student remained silent, astonishing everyone. He struggled with internal voices and questions, finding no peace even in his silence. Seeking the monk's advice, he was told, you must distance yourself from these inner voices. Go to the forest and find solitude. The student obeyed, venturing deep into the forest. Days turned into weeks, and the ashram feared for his safety. Three months later, he returned, transformed. His face was peaceful, and he was calm. He spoke smoothly, with a newfound gentleness. He asked the monk, Am I still silent? Is my resolution still on? The monk looked into his eyes and said, Yes, you are still silent, both outwardly and inwardly. Your resolution is complete. The student shared his revelation. In the forest, I realized how my harsh words had hurt others. My inner voices tormented me until they finally vanished. True silence brought me peace, allowing me to hear the world's natural sounds clearly for the first time. The monk explained, Our troubles stem from speaking too much. We must learn to conserve our energy and embrace silence. Only then can we turn inward and find true tranquility. He added, Speaking excessively drains us. It prevents us from listening and understanding. When we turn inward and embrace silence, we conserve our energy and find peace. This is the true path to inner strength and enlightenment. The student had learned a valuable lesson. He understood that true strength came from within and that silence was a powerful tool for personal growth. He began to speak only when necessary, choosing his words carefully and with kindness. This story teaches us the power of silence. In our busy world, we often forget to stop and listen. We talk, argue, and try to prove our points, but we rarely take the time to understand others or ourselves. Silence allows us to reflect, to hear the world around us, and to find peace within. By embracing silence, we can conserve our energy and focus on what truly matters. We can avoid unnecessary conflicts and misunderstandings. When we speak less, we listen more and our relationships improve. We become more aware of our surroundings, our thoughts, and our actions. You can start by setting aside a few minutes each day to be silent. Turn off your devices, find a quiet place, 
and just sit in silence. Listen to the sounds around you, the thoughts in your mind, and the feelings in your heart. Over time, you will find that this practice brings you peace and clarity. Silence can also help us in our interactions with others. Instead of rushing to speak, take a moment to listen. Consider what the other person is saying and respond thoughtfully. This will make your conversations more meaningful and reduce misunderstandings.